So many of you know I like my privacy because I like thinking too much. And when we think too much, we write very important things. Can you say your name? I am going to begin this sharing of testimony. We are Sunday, December 11, 2022. Uh, a few things are reflected on and I wrote down. To begin with, the first important aspect of this testimony. Let me read as it's written here so that I don't talk too much and leave one. As a matter of fact, on my book diary right here, there are roughly 14 items summarized. Amen. Amen. Some of you know a lot about it. To begin with, May 22nd, 2022, this year, this ministry and the other ministries were born. They were born. It was May 22nd. I remember Madame Eugenia was there that peace in the church, Pentecostal Christian Garden Church, also known as the Commonwealth Assembly of God, which will be the final name, as you see on the board right here, was born. Amen. Amen. Right here. It was born right here. Amen. I am grateful to the Lord for many things. It took a miracle to come here. I just expected it. As a matter of fact, I left work and I'm here to greet a colleague. And they I called Mr. Dennis. Mr. Dennis planning to come for healing service at Redeemer. And I told him there is no more Redeemer activity. And he said, why don't we start here? We had a work, a call that was locked here for roughly two years or thereabouts. And that is it. God answered on the spot. And we've been serving so. Amen. Not only did the church begin, let me quote scripture, I will build my church. And the word church is ecclesia, which means people. Yes. Uh, it also means the garden of sense like we are. And the gates of Hades will not prevail against it. How many believe this ministry cannot die? Yes. So God has been actively building his church. Let me prove to you first thing first. On the board there and on that video projector is proof of it. He sent me and he bought it. That's an expensive equipment. Last night I was here with Joel and Dennis and we were testing the mixer. But that is an HM mixer, brand new digital mixer. With an inbuilt amplifier, what built it. Uh, attached to that, you have the other accessories like the mic and you see the speaker. What more speaker is there? Very small, but pretty. God built it. The drum set is here, brand new. God built it. He built it. And of course, you have the light stand and many other things. The point is this so many things are going on. Next important thing about this ministry that started off, can I surprise you with it? Impactful ministration. Last night, no, yesterday in the afternoon, I was back from work. A man who were working some documents and ministering to. Finally, his passport is available. And he's traveling to the UK. That's a dead soul man. Answer prayer. Not only that, lives have been changed. Some people got born again, many healings and deliverance, including people who conceive supernaturally. If the ministry was not born and we didn't have a place to worship, some of these things would not have been happening. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, say it on my behalf. Shout it out. Thank you. Declare God, you are good. God, you are good. Say it again, God, you are good to us. Next testimony on my list, God made me to see January 1st, 2022. I don't know about you. You are here because you saw January 1st. I don't know whether you understand what I'm saying. You know what it means to see New Year? Others die on the eve, December 31st. So I have crossed over with my whole family and the Lord preserved us. Hallelujah. Amen. That's a testimony. You don't know about that. That's a testimony to me. I saw it in my life. January to December, 12 months and counting, he's been keeping me. Amen. Next aspect of this testimony is that there's been no hospital admission in my family. Amen. None. None. God is None. I don't know about that. None. Actively healing people. You serve the Lord, he keeps you. But it works. It's a mystery. I've thought about that extensively and you know so. Next aspect of my testimony is multiple job openings. Amen. Teaching. Three different schools, many seven different classes is an evangelism platform for me. Basically, talking to roughly 400, 300 young people every day is an awesome privilege. It means a lot to me because it has a unique opportunity to talk to people. Proof of it, this is Boris, my student, seated right here on the drums. That is Timothy, sitting right there. And you have Henry behind, and many others who are not here. Some of it actually watching online. Ben is there because Tim is a student. Amen. <laughs> I wrote you, I've come to a bigger class now. I 
I'm not lecturing, I'm not teaching her right now. It's an awesome thing. Not only that, unique opportunity to serve God, to combine all these things yet struggle free and much more teaching impactfully in church. So this is the fourth class in the fourth school of lecturing. Praise God. And teaching with precision. Strength has been coming from who? God. From God. Zechariah 4, verse 6, not by power, but by the Spirit of God. Beyond that has been God. No man deserves no credit. I mean no man. I know no man after the flesh. It's a declaration I'm putting up front. And angels are joining me right now. You want to hear another aspect of this testimony? Oh, yes. Please? Oh, yes. How many remember March 18 and March 19? Especially March 19. It was a Saturday. Yes. We got married. Wow. Oh, yeah, that's a big miracle. It's been 2022 of multiple blessings. We got married. Not only that, prayers we have been praying for privately, God answered. Several of my cousins have this year. It's a miracle. Their families, people don't get married. The Lord has been answering. So we got married, and it was an, an awesome marriage. It was an awesome wedding event. Yes. You remember that? Yes. Many of you were right in this. My mother is here, my mother in law is here. They were right there. I'm here and with the same dress. Mr. Dennis is here with the same dress. He was there. I remember he's still on the video. And many others who are here. Mr. Bell was there on the bridesmaid. Dre was right there serving. It's an awesome thing. It takes divine grace to marry right. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. Next important thing is that September 4th, I got the first book launched, published, and of course made available for reading. Ministry of Emotional Healings is here. Can I tell you the shocking thing? So far, more than 75 copies have been given out. Some given for free, some ordered, some paid for, and people came in that they didn't even want to and take a copy, just e-copies. And they paid for more printing. God has been there. Amen. And more is coming because December 25th, before we reach there, second book on unveiling the mystery of tithing will be published. You will see it. Nothing was covered in Jesus' name. Amen. Now, there's been extraordinary provisions for this church, both financially and materially. I can't be small, it will take up much time. This venue is a miracle we are here. Virtually for free. Virtually for free. I mean, virtually, you're not hearing that. Virtually for free. If it was to start renting this place, where would I take money from? Mindful of the fact that we are a tender church, we are still building. If it was our people who we are ministering to attending this place, this hall will be small for us. Yes. But these ones who are actively present, ministering every day, I value you so much. So I thank God for your life. Amen. Now, guess what? You want to hear something bigger now? Yes. November 28, 2022, the newest member of this church came. <laughs> so you know, bring this beyond right there. Yes. And very soon we'll be seeing her. We'll pray for her. You, 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 I mean, the newest member. She told me this morning she's excited to come to church. She came, she woke up early at around five. Praise God. Amen. Now, our ministrations have been having remarkable effects on people. As a matter of fact, we are having social media leadership. When we teach others actually take sermons out of it. Praise God. Amen. It's a privilege. Yes. The inspiration is mind boggling Next thing is, let me just mention this attached to the books. It means a lot to me. I'm showing you what God has done for me. That's my testimony. So far, there are over seven written books, pending editors. I mean it. They give you the material with insightful content. Praise God for that. Praise God for that. Amen. You don't know the mystery of books until you get to understand the mystery of books. We read the Bible because it's a mystery book. Praise God. Amen. Now, since 22nd of May 2022, as we started off, do you know we have not skipped any Sunday worship service? Yes. I many remember some Sunday services, God shows we are lying on the floor. My yes. daughter is here. Where is your daughter? The following Sunday, she says she's not coming to that shooting church again. Praise God. God has been keeping us and we are actively worshiping. Behind that divine protection was God. No man. I mean it. No man. Yes. Next thing is, you won't remember very well, but around June, July, how we used to come here to worship is a long story. There were times my bike had a lot of issues when the soldiers had blocked the entrances of the main road and bikes had to go through almost like passing to this place. Many people will not know. Queen was in the belly and we were actively traveling each break. Amen. Going through those portals. Never harass, 
never ever intimidated by no thief, nothing. Who kept us? God. The Lord kept us. Now, I talked about social media leadership. You may not understand it yet, Mama, but let me just mention this. There are souls changed right now, including people I don't know physically, by virtue of our social media activities. Oh. Not only that, God has been helping us to communicate wide and loud. On purpose, Facebook, for instance, has been restricting most of my posting views because of the increased visibility. They expect me to be paying so that they spread more to people. And the Lord is making provisions pay time. Amen. Say we will not be left out. We will not be left out. Amen. Amen. Next thing is, uh, all my parents are alive. All my in-laws class, I checked, they are okay. Praise God. Amen. They're not saying anything. And my immediate family, my wife is here very soon, we will be talking very soon after this. All okay. Nothing wrong. Everyone kept. Last I checked. Who has been keeping us? The Lord. The Lord has been actively keeping us and may his name be praised in Jesus' name. Here is John 15 verse 5. Without me, you can do nothing. Without me. Behind all what is mentioned here and the others have reserved, it's been God. Next thing is, unless God builds the house, the devil invades that building. Do you remember that? Yes. Psalm 127, verse 1 to 2. Unless he watches over the city, they stand guard in vain. Behind all the preservation, the protection, the provision, the miraculous provisions, and all the awesome things listed with God, he takes all the credit. Do you know God wants to be worshipped? Yes. Not by power nor might. Hosea 1 7, Isaiah 11 2 to 4, Zechariah 4 6. It's been God doing all these things for me. Remember this, Deuteronomy 8 18. I am the Lord that gives you the power to make wealth. This is the basis for thanksgiving. When you establish these things, you can be very happy. Next thing is Psalm 125. As the mountain surrounds Jerusalem, the Lord surrounds people both now and forevermore. God has been actively keeping me personally. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Wisdom comes from God. Strength comes from God. Behind the wisdom, the strength, and to do all these awesome things, it's been God. It's been God. It's been God. Come on, give me a clap of him. It sounds like you are rapping for yourself. I can't say that at all. Let the heavens hear that. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Quickly, I'll call my wife. Please bring the dog, the child, right here. Let's just continue with this testimony and wrap up before the next week. Hallelujah. Let's get the baby. Get the baby. Dennis. Hallelujah. Be careful. Praise God. Hallelujah. She's busy sleeping. Turn it. Let the people see her. Follow the direction of the camera right here. Mm. Doesn't she look beautiful? Very You're all jealous. <laughs> That's the only most beautiful child on earth. Welcome. Let me touch you. So <laughs> wonderful. Her name is Nchanji. You the queen Nesinyo. Okay. Nesinyo means to praise God, to glorify God. It's a name. It's Nimo. You the queen means wise, wealthy people. Wow. Totally devoted to God. Wow. You are also in riches and wealth here. This is wealth manifestation. Oh, yes. She is potential waiting to be unleashed. Oh, yes. 14 days old, as you sing her. Wow. Very active and strong. Praise God. You want to say something? Good morning, Judge. Good morning, Madam. I'm so happy to be here to be in this building. After a long time. <laughs> like, as you see, it's a miracle. I really appreciate God because so many women go to the level one and come back empty. Yeah. So I really thank God. This is a blessing. Like my husband has said, her name is Eden Queen Mesimu. So we have a new member in our midst. We are asking you to pray for us and this child because on our own we will not be able to raise this child and with your support and prayers we believe we will be able to raise this child that she will go to save only God. Thank you a lot. We know we have, you have been praying for us and we keep asking to continue pray for us and this ministry Thank that you. it should grow. Thank you. Praise God. Amen. A word of prayer, special hands, and speak prophetic things into our destiny. 
Yes. Say things, declare words. You've seen me do it. God You've seen me dedicate to pray. It's time to pray for her. Divine protection. Yes, this is the gift you've given us, Lord. A wonderful potential to manifest. Trapped within her are great things. The communication is free for her. And thanksgiving to you. It's a miracle that she's here. We give you praise, Lord. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise for you, the pain. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Queen will grow up to be a wonder to behold. Say amen. Come on. I decree over her life as a spiritual leader. No disaster shall come near her. Amen. No weapon fashion against her shall prosper. Amen. An exceptional child she will be in her generation. Yes. Great things will be spoken of her. Yes. She will be a major battle axe in the hand of the Lord. Yes. To molest and de and disdain the kingdom of darkness. Yes. She will grow on in the, in the house of the Lord. Yes. And will grow in the fear of the Lord. Yes. This word shall come to pass. Amen. Great is the destiny to be unleashed. Amen. This is a kingdom financier in the making. Amen. A great child. Yes. Bearing with exceptional talents. Oh, yes. To God alone be the glory for all the awesome things he's done. Amen. We bless her soul. And we decree protection over her in Jesus' name. Amen. She's saying she wants to see it. Yes. Praise God. Please just, just take a seat. So this Hallelujah. Is Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Uh, Last thing about this testimony, you are my greatest testimony. Yes. I need the ushers to have some people. Right? You are my greatest testimony, Virginia. You are my greatest testimony. It's an awesome thing to be exposed to you all. Madam Marie Claire, good to see you. No more court cases. That's your sister. I remember her. Welcome. If you are feeling cool, you'll be warmed up very soon. Praise God. I'm so happy to see you all. Please let me end right here and help others do 